some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we have a mother and son team of frauditors whose MO is usually to go antagonize people at churches. But today, they're just out on the streets and they end up choosing the wrong store to film in front of and get surrounded by a crowd of people who don't want them in the area. So, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hello and welcome to this installment of First Amendment Rights. Today I'm in the city of Laguna Beach, California. We're doing First Amendment audit in the area to see if some of the local businesses, shops, and restaurants will be respecting our right to record in public this evening. Stay tuned and we'll see how things go. There you go. Restrooms are for customers only. In case anyone's wondering down here at the Wharf restaurant. No, he totally cares. Oh my god, who the hell cares? Oh, such hard hitting journalism. You are going to be great. You are going to be the next Peter Jennings. Um, no, no, that not, not, no, no, not, no, let's not go that far. Okay, let's try this. How about the laziest reporter at your local high school? Wait, 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 never mind. I would suppose even that's a bit of a stretch, too. Ask what the video is for? Uh, sure. Well, I don't want the camera yeah. on me. Oh, well, you got my attention. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just curious. Oh, okay. Just curious. Yeah, you can be curious. Sure. But no, is there a, a, a reason huh? why you're doing it? Because you're you're focusing on Oh, yeah. Just filming, recording. Oh, why don't you go in and tell the truth? Uh, you're filming because you've got nothing better to do with your life than be an antagonistic asshole, right? Yeah, that sounds about right. An antagonistic asshole. Okay. Yeah. Is, should I have a reason? <laughs> no, we're just wondering. Oh, okay. Yeah, we yeah. have a lot of customers that film the store, so we were just wondering. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. You can be curious. I'll we'll stop you there. Bye. Have a good night. Huh? I'm just doing some recording. Okay. For what? I'm not going to discuss that right now. Have a good evening. Hi. Anything personal? Huh? We were just asking you why are you taking picture of every store. And who are you? I'm the owner of that place. Why am I taking pictures you, of every... Why are you asking me questions? Because you're taking a picture, which is oh, okay. not right. It's not right? Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. It's not right. Why is it not right? Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened to respecting your parents? I mean, you may be an adult, but don't ever cut your mother off from speaking. I mean, if you're doing that right now, I can only imagine how you were as a child. I mean, jeez. Kind of makes me wonder if your mother was a single parent and you were quite a hellion as a child, weren't you? Yeah, that's it. Your mother had to work to support you and there was nobody there to discipline you. That certainly would explain a lot about you. Because our shop gets broken into, people come and take pictures. Well, this is a and tourist to town, the isn't it? Because we have you call the police? Right to ask you why you're taking and I have a right pictures. to decline answering you, sir. Huh? I have a right to decline answering you. Then stop doing this. Go back stop to your store. Stop doing this. Excuse don't take me? picture of any store without their permission. I don't need permission. Yes, you need permission. No, I don't. This sidewalk belongs to them. This sidewalk is public. Over there, then you can take those. This sidewalk pictures. belongs to you the want city. Me to call the police. Go right ahead. Yes. Okay, I will do that. You do that. I'll you, do that. You do you that. You can follow me too. Thank you. Yeah. You do that. Let's yeah. go call the police. Yeah. Let's go call the police. Hey, you can call them right here. You want some enlightenment on the law? 
Yeah. There's some information about public photography. I know that. You know, you know the law. Know that, if things. you knew the law, then you wouldn't be bothering me. No, I will bother you because there's a personal thing here. Well, if you're gonna call them for your feelings, they're not gonna do anything. You will see. So this is the guy from the sunglass shop that we were checking out earlier. Came and followed you us. Just down tell the me sidewalk. what you're doing, then I'll go away. I'm, I don't have to tell you what I'm doing. Yeah, then don't take picture when you don't have to say anything. So we don't have to tell you to stop doing this. Pardon me, sir. Uh, that pamphlet you're reading is quite worthless. Uh, I don't think I'd even use it for toilet paper. Simply because it was written by a fraudster who thinks he knows the laws, but you know. They don't actually know a damn thing. You don't tell me what to do on a public sidewalk, friend. How about if I tell you to get off your phone and go back inside? You wouldn't like that, would you? The sidewalk belongs to everybody, buddy. The sidewalk belongs to everybody, buddy. The sidewalk belongs to everybody, buddy. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it does. Yeah. So you have a right to call the police. I have a right to stand out here and record. Excuse me, sir. What's up? You're in the glass shop, right? Yeah, he's taking pictures of everybody going inside the store without friend. telling us why you're taking pictures. That's cool. That guy's cool. That's cool. Yeah. We didn't you say anything. Tell me what the f is wrong with you. Huh? What you told me? We don't say anything. We're filming everything out here. That's a really good friend of mine. All right. Glass shop. I bought glass off. Everybody in the whole unit. Okay. If you want to f him, you know, bro, if I didn't have a beer right now, I'd get out. Get the fuck out, but I'm not gonna do it. Oh, wow. Get the fuck out. We're on a public sidewalk. No, dude, that's just kind of rude. Oh, yeah, you gotta love it when the uh, average citizen stands up to these morons, these grifters, these fraudsters. It is such a beautiful sight. He, he came he up to us. us. He Isn't followed us up the street. Well, if you want to interject us. yourself into the video, then, the then let's talk. I didn't go in your store. Don't don't well, then don't go out in public. This is a tourist attraction. Yeah. It's a tourist town. What are you guys talking about? This, 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 huh? Respect the rules. Yeah. What rules? If they have rules that say don't film inside Okay, let me ask. Hold on, hold on. Let me ask. If I if I if I was inside the store, that would be 100% true. Out in public, we all have the right to record. You know? Yeah, you want some information about public photography? So you want to stay ignorant then? Would you like information about public photography? Okay, so stay ignorant. That's what I'm doing. Photography is my day. I'm not touching your property. Oh, my car, dude. Get it on camera. Bro, that's my friend right there. That's my friend, bro. Hey, that's, that's my friend, bro. I love that guy. That's fine. You can love him all you want. so cool. Yeah. You want the glass shop? Oh, it's that bottle of glasses. Everybody got yeah, sunglasses. Here Pretty cool. I don't want them to take the yeah. of my store. You don't even know me. You make your accusations just because of something you guys don't you're understand. Right you're a nice person. Like I said, I like to take public photography, capture life as it happens. But everyone down here seems to have an issue. Where are you from? Huh? Where are you from? I'm from Los Angeles. Where All right, from? I'm from Orange County. Cool. Yeah. So well, why film somebody when they don't want to? It's like why walk up to a camera? If a camera's running and you don't want to be on camera, then why approach that person with the camera? That's kind of like saying that's kind of like saying I don't want to get wet, but I jump in a pool. You know. I'm just saying someone is so desperate for we got 20 people watch your YouTube videos. No, no, like 50,000 to 100,000 sometimes. Super cool. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Super cool. No wonder. He's still on the. Shitty ass glasses. You think you're Steve McQueen? <laughs> Steve McQueen. <laughs> Says the guy that smells like beer. <laughs> so are they coming? Yeah, they're coming. Okay, cool, cool. Cool. All right. It's harassment, is what it is. He walked up to us. He followed us. He followed us. That's fine. Well, they're, they're not going to do anything because they enforce law. There's no law being broken out here. Police enforce law, not feelings.
Huh? It's not a who cares? Who cares? How 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 would you like it? How would you like it if I told you to take off that hat? You can't wear that hat out here. How would I? Wow, your analogies really suck. Work on that. I mean, you comparing him to wearing his hat to you, sticking your camera in everybody's faces. Well, that's essentially like comparing apples to oranges. It's essentially meaningless and have nothing to do with each other. How about if I told you to take off that purse? That's an ugly no, purse. I took the purse because I respect people. You would? How about if I told you to take off the scarf? Sure. Cut your hair. I, I don't like your hairstyle. Um, you, you cut your hair? Huh? Take off your glasses, shave your beard. I don't like how you look, you know? It's offending me, you know? It's, it's bothering me. See, it's petty, you know? Everything you're doing is petty. Looking for a reaction. Well, you're giving it to me, so thanks. Yeah, you're gonna get it. The longer, you, the longer, wrong, the longer you talk to the camera, yeah, the longer. Is this the reaction? This is like this gets you, like, this gets you like the cool views, harassing people. On nobody, the nobody told him to walk up to me. Nobody told you guys to engage us. Nobody told you him to that come up your own free will. Y'all need to get some friends for real. Like this. Is yeah, get sad. a life. I think, like, I think need they're life. looking get for. Get on with your life. <laughs> <laughs> hey bro, that makes sense. Yeah. I love you, man. I love you. He's like, this guy. Well, apparently you don't have to stop the So our friend from the uh, sunglass store, just down the sidewalk, followed us around the corner here. That's our friend who the glass shop. He's on the police. He's on the phone with the police right now. No, he followed us up the street. Your phone, We didn't follow him. He followed us. I don't care. He lives here. I'll say you do what you want. I live here too. Wow, you live here? Somehow I don't believe that. But you know what? Lying comes easy to these frauditors. It's as easy for them as breathing. Well, why does everybody just be happy and have a nice night? I am having a night. I am having a good night. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't worry about it. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. A lot of people down here obviously are un uneducated on their basic rights in America. <laughs> so you're harassing no, we're not huh? harassing anybody. No, you just showed up on scene and you're making your assumptions, but that's fine. You can do that. You're you're you're, you're entitled to your opinions. I want to talk to us, so stop talking to me. Well, then you're disengage. Police aren't going to do nothing, guys. Well, now we all know how this kind of thing ends. The cops show up, but they don't do anything about the frauditor and that's how this one ended there's nothing wrong with public photography but using it as a vehicle for antagonizing the average citizen on the streets now that is a problem